Darrell Jazz Johnson here. Darrell Johnson here with the Gospel Herald. Raz Jazz Sports here with Kenton Facey from the uh, UConn Huskies. How you doing tonight? I'm great right now. So you guys are off to the uh, off to the Elite Eight. You'll be playing again on Sunday. What does that mean to you? What does that mean to the team? I mean, to the team, it's just a great opportunity for us to come together again and show what we're made of and try to make a great run to try to win this tournament. Uh, for me personally, it's just a great experience to be part of some this great in my first year of college. What What are some of the things just just with with today with yesterday? What What are some of the things that you're enjoying about about this Sweet 16 experience and now this Elite Eight experience? Uh, personally, it's it's the entire environment. You know, like playing in the garden, all this media and all that stuff. It's like a professional atmosphere in a sense. Getting a chance to catch up with my teacher right here, that's part of it too for me. So that that's definitely part of the, the festivities. I, I food and all that. I mean there's a food twenty four seven, so that's definitely a plus. They definitely take care of you guys over here. Uh one of your teammates, Terrence, uh last two games his number's been called, comes up with eleven points in the last round, ten points tonight. What 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 does that say about this team and, and, and how everyone on the team is ready to come in and make a contribution? This 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 team is it's, it's a very good team. So you you can't see someone on the bench and judge judge that they they're not a good player. Anyone on this team can step up at any time and contribute on any level. And Terrence is a testimony to that because he stepped up the last couple of games. We needed him to step up, and he stepped up big and he helped us out to to come up with the win. This team had a had a legendary coach uh, who's been here for for decades. Who's here tonight? What does it mean for UConn to have uh, Jim Calhoun here? I mean, he, he serves as a, as a mentor to a lot of guys. He's always there if you need help with anything. He's a great basketball mind, so you can always ask him any question as pertaining to basketball and life as a whole because he's been around for, for a long time. Now, Coach Ali has taken over for a legend. What, what makes uh, Coach Ali able to, to succeed so quickly, especially replacing a legend like Calhoun? I mean, play, I mean... I would say playing under him, he, had, he learned a lot from Coach Calhoun and having him around now sort of as a source he could uh, confide in or get advice from sometimes if he needed. So I think that's definitely a plus for Coach Calhoun to be around for us and Coach Ali. All right, thank you for, for your time. Good luck to you and your teammates on, on Sunday. And, and hopefully we're back here Sunday, Sunday at some time having a conversation with you again. All right.